Hello, I'm in Pornstar, and before I get into my topic today, uh, in the background you're watching a, a, a double mob on the map Arcade and Modern Warfare 3 using the ACR, the special loadout, and each of these streaks are about 3 minutes long or something, so, you know, the, 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 the mobs are, like, decent, I suppose. So, yeah, that's just a, the background, the gameplay in the background, a double mob on Arcade. So, the topic we're going to go... Wanna, what I want to talk about today is um, the PS4 and the Xbox One which are going to be released later this year and basically my thoughts on each of them so as you know the Xbox One's already been revealed and you know it, it looks pretty decent but the PS4 it's, it's going to be released in a few days at E3 I think that's what someone told me uh, E3 in a few days and we've already seen the controller for the PS3. It's got like a kind of touch screen in the middle of it, which you know I, w I want to see what's going to be going on with that. You know, it looks a bit weird. I'm not really sure what you're going to be able to do with that. Maybe if you, I don't know, like calling kill streaks or something. Maybe voice command, whatever. I'm not really sure because I think there is going to be a voice command on these consoles or uh, maybe the consoles or the new calls. I'm not quite sure which one it is. But personally, I'm probably gonna go for the PS4, just because you know I'm I'm a PS3 gamer. I don't really, I don't really go on the Xbox too much. I mean, I'm I'm top level on every COD, but I haven't gone to the highest prestige. Just did at the level. Whereas on PS3, I'm highest prestige on every single Call of Duty. Um, you know, I just I just prefer PS4 altogether. You know, that's it's where I started and I'm probably just gonna end it on here on the PS4. So I'll probably get the PS4 but you know hopefully the graphics will be better. Well they will be better anyway. Because the PS4 graphics are nicer than the and the PS3 graphics are nicer than the Xbox 360's graphics. Uh, I think and the sound is a little bit nicer as well. Um like going through your headset. I feel as though like the sound's nicer and the graphics are better on the PS3 so if there's any improvement on that on the PS4 I mean the graphics will just be amazing so yeah that, that'll be good but I'm really looking forward to this E3 where they're going to re reveal the PS4 and I, I really want I, I really want to see what this uh, PS4 looks like you know what features it has like how much gigabytes it has like all of the new features what they're going to get in it I mean, it's just going to be such an amazing console to play on, you know, and the new Call of Duty is coming out on the PS3 and PS4, so, you know, Call of Duty Ghost, I'm not really quite sure what to, what console to get it on, um, PS3 or PS4, I'm not quite sure, but I'm probably just going to get it on the PS3, because I want to try and get, like, you know, to a really high rank. You know, in the career, like if the leaderboards are the, if the leaderboards are the same as Modern Warfare 3, you know I'm gonna try and get really high in this game because I'm off school uh, for most of it. You know, so I've got loads of spare time, and um, so I, I want to get quite high up in the rankings right there, where well, uh, which will be um you know it'll take a little, lot of effort, but you know it is possible if you put enough time in. Um, I wasn't on I wasn't Black Ops 2. I was 3,000 from the first two months, but you know. I, as I know, Black Ops 2 is absolutely terrible. And some of you may think it's good, but I personally think it's the worst Call of Duty yet. I mean, the kill streaks are overpowered than that, but that's just another, that's just another topic altogether. I'm not going to talk about that. So, yeah, I'm probably going to get the Call of Duty Ghost on the PS3, and then, you know, if I get the PS4 at Christmas. I might get it on that, but it just depends if it affects your leaderboards and your accounts. I mean, that that's something what I really want to know. I mean, with the new PS4, I mean, do you get to keep your PS3 account? Can you transfer your PS3 account over to the PS4? You know, so you can keep all your trophies, you know, your, your username, and like all your stats on Call of Duty and all your other games you've got. I mean, if you can if you can't keep that and you have to make a completely new account and start from scratch you know, I'm, 
I'm gonna have to say I'm just gonna have to probably stay on the PS3 unless you can transfer all your stuff onto the PS4 because I'm not starting again all over I mean you know I'm highest prestige and everything and I just, I, I'm not gonna start again from scratch I'll just stay on the PS3 so if we found that out at, PS, uh, at E3 in a few days you know hopefully you know you can transfer your account so you can get all your stuff um, same with the Xbox um, same with the Xbox 3 uh, s Xbox One should I say you know you can transfer your account back onto that onto the Xbox One from the Xbox 360 so you can keep all your stuff you know these are things what I, what I really want to find out but um, yeah we're just going to have to find out in a few days I suppose and the next thing is you know the new Call of Duty you know I'm wondering what it's going to be best to play on PS3, PS4 I mean a uh, PS3, PS4, Xbox 360 or the Xbox One you know because there's four consoles two of them are going to be coming out and what I'm thinking is all of the people who are really into gaming you know all the triads I'm thinking that they're going to be getting the Xbox One and PS4 so if you do get that there'll be just you know like loads of good players on there and there won't be really any bad players well there will be bad players but there'll be a lot of good players on there because you know they'll, they'll be wanting to get the console as quick as they can so yeah I'm I'm gonna get on the PS3 I'm gonna stay on the PS3 actually that was a good plan that get Call of Duty goes for the PS3 stay on PS3 until the next Call of Duty comes out which I don't know what we, well we obviously don't know what that is yet um, and then I'll buy the PS4 that year probably that sounds like a good idea to me but I'll probably do it I'll probably, I'm, I'm gonna get the PS4 as well so so yeah, I'm overdoing this commentary really. I don't really know what I'm talking about anymore. So yeah, it's been double mob and PS4 Xbox One topic. And I'll see you in the next video. See you later guys. Bye.